Hello everyone. Welcome to the channel English Classes. I am Dr. Sharda here to help you learn English. Today we are going to discuss a poem A Little Grain of Gold which is written by Rabindranath Tagore and this is taken from the first year English textbook unit 2. Let us know about the poet. Rabindranath Tagore was the first Indian to win Nobel Prize. He is a multifaceted personality. Tagore was a writer, musician, painter and educationist. He was a man of genius who wrote prolifically. His works include poems, short stories, plays and critical essays. He composed our national anthem. He founded the world famous educational center Shantiniketan. His words are remarkable for their simple style and universal appeal. His Nobel Prize winning compilation Geetanjali is a collection of song offerings celebrating the glory of God. What is the poem about? The poem A Little Grain of Gold is from Tego's Geetanjali. It tells us an interesting parable. It sounds simple but conveys a valuable message. The poem highlights the virtue of giving. It effectively drives home the point that giving should come before taking. Thus it acquires a remarkable and universal appeal. The speaker in the poem, a beggar, was on his begging rounds. He saw a king of all kings coming his way in a gorgeous chariot. He was excited thinking that he would get plenty as arms. But the king, to the beggar's shock and surprise, asked him what he would give. The beggar thought it was a royal joke. He slowly took out the least little grain of corn from his bag and gave it to the king. That evening, the beggar found the least little grain of gold in his arms. He wept bitterly. He wished he had the heart to give all his to the king, who in fact was God. Now let us get into the poem. Stanza 1 I had gone a begging from door to door in the village path when thy golden chariot appeared in the distance like a gorgeous dream and I wondered who was the king of all kings. The speaker in the poem is the beggar and the poem is addressed to God. The beggar was begging in the village path from door to door. He saw a king's golden chariot approaching him from a distance. He could not believe it. He thought it could be a dream. He was surprised and thought who could be the king of kings sitting in the chariot. Stanza 2 My hopes rose high and me thought my evil days were at an end. And I stood waiting for arms to be given unasked and for wealth scattered on all sides in the dust. The beggar hoped that he would get arms from the king in the chariot without asking. He felt happy that the generous king would bestow wealth on him. All his sorrows would come to an end. He waited for the arms. Stanza 3 The chariot stopped where I stood. Thy glance fell on me and Though came as down with a smile, I felt that the luck of my life had come at last. Then of a sudden thought its hold out thy right hand and say, What has thou to give to me? The chariot stopped near the beggar. The king looked at him and got down from the chariot, smiling at him. He felt that the luck of his life had come. But in contrary to his expectation, the king rose up his right hand and asked what the beggar had with him to give to the king. Stanza 4 Ah, what a kingly jest was it to open thy palm to a beggar to beg. I was confused and stood undecided, and then from my wallet I slowly took out the least little grain of corn and gave it to thee. The beggar thought that it was a royal joke on him. The king, 
whom he thought the richest one and would give him wealth was in turn expecting from the beggar he was confused and not able to decide anything the beggar took out the smallest grain of corn and handed it to the king stanza 5 but how great my surprise when at the day's end i emptied my bag on the floor to find a least little grain of gold among the poor heap i bitterly wept and wished that i had had the heart to give thee my all at the end of the day the beggar emptied his bag on the floor and to his surprise he found the smallest grain of gold in that heap of grains then he realized his foolishness he wished that he had the heart to give all which he had to the king then he would have got all his grains turned into gold now let us see the overall summary of the poem a little grain of gold is the 50th poem in geetanjali in the poem tagore depicts the strange ways in which god tests his devotees the speaker of the poem is a beggar one day as he is seeking alms from door to door in the village he suddenly sees a magnificent chariot approaching the beggar is dazzled and elated by its splendor he wonders whether the chariot is real or he is dreaming his joy knows no bounds he concludes that the owner of the golden chariot is a very rich king he is sure that the king will notice him the generous king would bestow wealth on him all his woes would come to an end he felt that the luck of his life had come at last the king came down from the chariot and looked at the beggar with a smiling face but contrary to his expectation the king himself held out his hand asking for alms the beggar took out the smallest grain of corn from his bag and offered it to the king reluctantly at the end of the day the beggar returned home and emptied his bag on the floor to his great surprise he found a little grain of gold in the heap of alms then he realized his foolishness he wished that he had the heart to give his all to the king because in that case he would have back his all grains turned into gold the beggar expected rich alms from the king but contrary to his expectation the king himself begged alms from the beggar god sometimes comes down on the earth in the guise of a poor beggar to test a man if he is ready to sacrifice his all to god so it was not really a kingly jest the poem highlights the virtue of giving it effectively drives home the point that giving should come before taking thus it acquires a remarkable and universal appeal so the poem makes us realize the importance of giving unconditionally what we give we will receive later in appropriate multiples by god hope you understood the poem and learnt a moral from it thank you for watching this do like share and subscribe